So guys, this is just a very quick video to show you how to uh, raise the handlebar of your mountain bike. So to do that, actually, it's very easy. Um, I search around and go out and uh, purchase it on this kit. Um, it cost me about, I think, $9 or something from eBay. You have that shipped to your door, everything included. It will add about extra, about four and a half inch to the pole in here. So raise it about four and a half inch up. So this piece uh, come just like that. Um, didn't have any instruction and anything. And um, the long bolt, a couple more small bolt here. To make this uh, upgrade, you're gonna need two hex wrench. In my case, uh, this bolt here is four millimeter, and the one that on the top is five millimeter, and also the one that on my bike is also five millimeter. So this kit That's actually comes with um, a few different sizes of color. So the idea is actually, you know, if you have a longer arm and uh, you know you're shorter or whatever. Uh, you can adjust it too, but in our case, I'm going to use all of them. So, let me show you how to do it. First things first is you need to uh, remove the handlebar from here. Okay, that should be easy enough. Take this out. There's two bowl here. It's a five millimeter. So I'm just gonna loosen. You can just simply loosen this. Remove them. And you can uh, lift this up. Put it down on the side first. That's the kit. So I take this piece out for now. Make sure these two bolts are loose. These two guys are four millimeter ones. Let me slide this part down first. We do it. There we go. What I usually do, I'm just going to tighten them a little bit, not too tight. <coughs> just enough that they will not be uh, spinning around too much. Put the wheel, the line back work. Put it back. So with both sides of the boat are put in place you sort of eyeball a little bit, you can tighten it slowly. So at this point it's kind of still loose, but the bolt's already in, it's not easy to take this out anymore. Now you want to tighten it down. When you tighten down these these bolt, these bolt, you want to do when you do one set at a time, you want to do low, high, low, high, so alternating. So for example, you do this. Oh, this one's not, it's not tight. When you're doing that, this will ensure you have a very good grip. Now at this point, it's still kind of eyeballing it because it's still kind of loose. So, but very soon, the lower one, Top one. Every time giving about like a quarter turn. So 
looks good, actually. I want to tighten this also. I do all four at the same time that way because I can align everything more, much better. Okay, now it's not completely tight yet, so we come to this side, straighten the bike. Okay, it looks very good to me. By no time, I can only move almost like one eighth of a turn at this point. Can't really move too much anymore because it's all locked down. Okay, so don't forget about this last piece. Um, you have to use the long bolt, but this piece I'm not going to use it actually. The original one, I like to keep it. I think it will work. This is 5mm for this piece, so let's put it like that. Looks good. Don't forget this little rubber piece to seal this hole. So uh, this is all done. Um, the installation is pretty simple. It only took me about five six minutes. Um, the result seems to be pretty good. It's uh, raised the handlebar for about four and a half inch, um, which is enough in our case. Um, hopefully, this video will help you to get some idea how to do your own uh, modification. Thank you for watching.